Hello Pixels, my name is Chaos, and today I'm reviewing the Die Place Woolmon. Now, of course, you might be hearing some kind of differences in my voice, I'm not sure, but it does really sound different. Now, for me, it is. Uh, I did lose my voice uh, because I was partying a bit too much yesterday, not to mention that uh, I did have a cold, and so I was also worrying about the server, so all that tension made me just lose my voice. But it's okay because... Just losing my voice won't hold me back. Anyways, today I'm reviewing the Die Place Wool mod. Now, this mod is pretty cool because it's amazing and very helpful for people who create pixel art. Now, it was really helpful for me too. I created like a little Mario sculpture, but that was in my other world. Anyways, with this mod, what you can do is basically use dyes in your hand to change the color of the wool. As you can see, this is green. I'll hit it with a blue dye and it'll turn blue. As you can see, this is blue. I'll hit it with a pink dye and it'll turn pink or magenta. I don't, I don't know. Uh, guys only take like random colors like that and that. It's some girls would call that neon. Some girls would call that green. I'll just call it green. <laughs> Anyways, uh, that's basically the gist of the mod. Now, as you guys know, you know you can't really uh, take a, another colored wool and try to change it to another color like a uh, light blue. But with this mod, it will allow you to do that. This is very helpful for people who are in creative or um, you know survival but they're still using you know dyes and colored wool to make pixel art on their world now that's basically the mod there's nothing else to say about it I hope you guys enjoyed this video I know there's nothing there wasn't too much to say about it but hello there little chicken let me just kill you really quick um, oh look at it I'm not gonna kill you just cuz you're so cute you're so cute oh yeah Why? now go and also I was working on the server, the server will be down for a while, it will be unlisted once it's up and once I do upgrade it to a new server soon, but that server will cost 60 bucks, but once I do, uh, that's when I will be releasing to the public and everyone can come on it. Thank you all so much for watching once again and I will see you all later. That looks like